In this video, I am going to show you how to import a Windows VM into Win VMware Workstation Player. First, we navigate to the folder which we have downloaded our Windows uh, VM and uh, you will find the, the format is actually a zip file. All we need to do now is to extract the zip file. Alright, right click and select extract all. And for the um, target uh, uh, folder, uh, I will just keep it as the default and perform the extraction. Alright, and it's going to take a while and so I'm going to pause the video and come back when the extraction is complete. Now, the um, extraction is complete and uh, you can see that there are three files uh, contained within the folder. Now, one of the files um, that is uh, contained within the folder is an OVF file, uh, which is actually a packaging format that uh, VMware Workstation understands. So now, um, by double-clicking, uh, let's just double-click the this file and see what happens. Now, double-clicking on it is going to fire up the VMware Workstation player with this uh, import virtual uh, machine uh, screen. So it's going to ask you for a name for this uh, new virtual machine as well as the location <coughs> to store the uh, new virtual machine. Now, if you're satisfied with this, just click import. However, do note that the destination uh, storage uh, path, okay, the folder, uh, should be on the partition that you have sufficient space to do so. Now let's go ahead and uh, import. And this is again going to take a little bit of time. So I will just pause the video and come back when all this is complete. Now the importing is done and the virtual machine should start up automatically. There you go. And uh, when you first uh, start up for the first time, uh, the VMware Workstation player is going to prompt you on whether you want to uh, install VMware tools for Vista and, la and later. So go ahead and install this. This is going to give you a little bit more features for the, for the management console. It's going to give it some more features. So go ahead and install while the your Windows 10 machine is starting up. There you have it, your evaluation Windows 10 machine is almost ready. There you go. This is the um, Windows 10 evaluation copy. And as you can see, it's licensed for 77 days. Right? The Windows license is valid for 77 days. And uh, you can use it. And uh, as you can see, there's no um, password is required to uh, start using the Windows machine. 